What's the market look like in Nashville's six hottest neighborhoods? We're going to look at prices, inventory, days on market, and other key numbers that are important to buyers and sellers. How's it going? I'm Justin Floyd, your guide to Nashville real estate and a generally good time. Appreciate you being here. If you're thinking about moving to Nashville or you already live here, I would love it if you'd hit subscribe. All right. Like I said, we're looking at the six most popular neighborhoods. There are other ones. We're not going to get all of them, but we're going to get six of the biggies. First, it's 12 South, known for its tree-lined streets, its bungalows, and of course, it's tourists. The median sales price for single family residential in May was 1.324 million. For inventory, there were 19 homes for sale in 12 South in May. While that doesn't sound like many, it's 137% more than there were a year ago. So it's trending in the right direction. Listings in May, if you were offering on one of these homes, safe to say you'd want to be close to ask for most of them because they were going for 97% of asking price in May. If you remember a year ago when it was absolutely insane, 12 South peaked at just a above 107% of ask price. So uh, we're actually in a better place than we were. The latest numbers show that houses are on the market for about nine days in 12 South. Next, we're moving adjacent to 12 South, just across Belmont Boulevard. It's Hillsboro Belmont neighborhood, uh, anchored by Belmont University, close to Vanderbilt University. It's known for its shops and its historic beautiful homes. The median sales price in May was $1.214 million in the Hillsborough Belmont neighborhood. Inventory, 13 homes for sale in May, down from 17 in January. Remember, these, these are small numbers because in some instances, these are very small areas of Nashville. If you're offering in Hillsborough Belmont, homes are going for 98% of ask price. It had been at 100 every single month since last July. Next, we're going to Wedgwood, Houston, sometimes referred to as WeHo. Don't call it WeHo. I don't know who calls it that, but it shows up. Anyway, uh, really the latest neighborhood to blossom in Nashville. It's home to Nashville's MLS team. They play at Geodas Park. Median sales price in Wedgwood, Houston was 780000 in May. That's up 9% year over year. And since January 1st, it's about even. 20 homes for sale in May. That's up from 10 in January. And listings, they're almost at 100, 99.7% of list price. It's almost always 100 in Wedgwood, Houston. Next up, Sylvan Park. It's, it's hard to get more charming than Sylvan Park. It's a West Nashville neighborhood, Locally owned restaurants, little shops, super walkable, close to downtown. Median sales price in May in Sylvan Park was just over $1 million. That's, uh, that's even since January. And year over year, it's up 19%. Only 18 listings in May. That's as low as inventory's been in the last three years in Sylvan Park. And the median days on market is only four. We're going to stay on the west side for this next neighborhood. It's trendy. It's growing and it's the nation's. Almost all new builds over there. Let's take a look. The median sales price right at $700,000 for a single family home. That's up slightly from January and up 17% year over year. In May, 48 homes for sale and that's up just a little bit from January of this year. The average days on market is 18 in the nation's. That's an opportunity for buyers. Finally, we're looking at East Nashville. We're doing all three zip codes. So these numbers, uh, some of these neighborhoods, we've said there are 13 listings. Well, not East Nashville, because we're going to do Lachlan Springs, Cleveland Park, Inglewood. That's three zip codes. If it doesn't make sense, then shoot your own video. It's mine and I make the rules. So here we go. Let's look at East Nashville numbers. The median sales price is right at $605,000 for May for a single family home, up slightly from January and year over year, it's a 13% increase. Okay, inventory in East Nashville, 352 homes for sale in May. That's up 19% year over year, a huge improvement. Average days on market is 19 and listings are going for close to 100% of ask price. 
Did I miss your favorite neighborhood? Probably. Am I willing to show you the stats on that neighborhood? Yes, let me know below and I will include it in an upcoming video. Hey, check me out online at Justin Floyd Homes on all the socials and justinfloydhomes.com. You can uh, hit me with questions there or below. Uh, again, I'd love it if you'd hit subscribe on this channel. Thank you so much. I'll talk to you next week.